Governor Andy Bashir is now talking about the experience of the last several weeks when he was being considered potentially for the VP spot on the National Democratic tickets. Earlier today, I talked with Bashir in a one on one interview for this weekend's Kentucky Newsmakers. For Kentucky's governor, it was a whirlwind after President Joe Biden left the race and endorsed Vice President Kamala Harris for his job, and Harris started looking for a running mate. Bashir was quickly on the radar. The governor traveled hard with trips to Iowa, Georgia, Oklahoma, and Chicago, touting Harris while her team vetted his background and weighed what he could bring to the ticket. Bashir says the attention on him paid dividends for Kentucky. Well, it's an honor. It's an honor to be considered. And how many people in their lives get vetted to potentially be a, a vice presidential running mate? But the thing I've loved the most about it is, is how we, Kentucky, have received hundreds of millions of dollars of positive publicity, of positive attention. You know, people out there are writing about our economy, uh, our achievements, how we're working together and the special things we're doing. Ultimately, Harris chose Minnesota Governor Tim Walz as her running mate, someone that Bashir considers a friend and someone who came to Bashir's inauguration and to the Kentucky Derby. Bashir says during his two-week sprint and all the scrutiny, his family was completely supportive, but he acknowledges staying home will be much less disruptive than a national role would have been. Listen, I've got a dream job right here being governor. My family is happy. The state has been so good to us. The town of Frankfurt uh, makes my kids' life as normal as it can be. Um, I am really blessed and, and thankful for the spot I'm in. In the middle of the VP speculation, the governor and first lady made a scheduled economic development trip to Japan and South Korea. And Bashir says that will benefit Kentucky. We, we've already had uh, an announcement from Mitsubishi Electric about the future of a plant in uh, Mason County. It's, it's a really exciting announcement. Uh, we've got some others that are coming up. I know we kept one company in Kentucky that was looking at, at otherwise going somewhere else. And we got a firm commitment from some of our biggest investors from that region that some of our largest projects will continue. So, yes, that trip was well worth it. Bashir also says his father, former Governor Steve Bashir, is private about his health but will be okay after an accident last week left him with injuries. 